Senate President Juan Miguel Zubiri said Filipino skilled workers would need to find better opportunities abroad in order to survive the rising prices of commodities and services. The lawmaker raises concerns that this might cause a shortage of skilled workers in the country. Mawawala na yung mga call center agents, mawawala na yung mga nurses, mawawala na yung mga doktor. Kanina, binanggit nyo about nurses. Marami sila umaabroad na. We cannot compete, unfortunately. Several bills have already been filed in Congress seeking a minimum wage increase. This includes Senate Bill No. 2002, which aims to increase the minimum wage by 150 pesos across the board. The Department of Labor and Employment said the proposed increase should be balanced to prevent micro, small and medium enterprises from shutting down. According to Senator Zubiri, he is open to amending the proposed 150 peso minimum wage hike all across the board for MSMEs. Lower rates for the wage hike will be given for micro, small, and medium enterprises. For larger companies, Senator Zubiri said they can afford a wage increase. A company earns, guys, billions a year. Can they not afford to make that little drop in the bucket sacrifice for their workers? First of all, if you have 1,000 employees, I don't think you'll make, I don't think you're making only 10 million a year. They can afford. Ang pag naman namin po sa kanila, Share naman po natin ito sa ating mga manggagawa. Meanwhile, the senator is also looking into increasing the wages of middle-income workers to encourage them to stay in the country. The Senate is set to discuss the proposed wage hike on May 10. Eileen Cerudo, UNTV News and Rescue. We serve the people. We give glory to God.